Have you ever pondered the intricacies of multiphase flows? Well, it's time to unravel the enigma. Multiphase flows, in essence, are flows that house more than one phase, such as gas, solid, and liquid. They're like a bustling city where diverse entities coexist, each with a unique role to play, much like in industrial settings where they're commonplace. Meet Amster CFD, your reliable partner in the realm of computational fluid dynamics CFD simulations. With several years of hands-on experience, we're adept at simulating a myriad of problems across various CFD fields using the sophisticated ANSYS Fluent software. Our services extend beyond modeling and meshing. We're prepared to undertake the most challenging projects, delivering simulations tailored to your specific needs. But that's not all. We also offer a free consultation with our seasoned experts to ensure your project gets off to a flying start. Choosing MR CFD isn't just about outsourcing your project, it's about joining a community. Along with your completed project, you'll receive comprehensive project files, tutorial videos, and continued technical support to help you navigate any potential roadblocks. So why wait? Reach out to us at info at mr-cfd.com and let's unravel the mysteries of multiphase flows together. Remember, in the world of CFD simulations, we're the trusted partner you need. Picture this. Gas liquid flows in evaporators and condensers, gas liquid solid flows in chemical reactors, solid gas flows in pneumatic conveying, each has a unique configuration of phases. But how do we know which phase is dispersed and which is continuous? It's all about the flow rates of both phases. For instance, in a gas liquid flow, imagine the gas as a fleet of small boats on a vast ocean. When the number of boats is low compared to the ocean's vastness, the gas phase is dispersed. However, when there are too many boats, the ocean becomes dispersed. This exchange of roles also occurs in liquid-liquid flows. It's fascinating to note that the transfer of mass, momentum, and energy between the phases is carried out from each particle, be it a solid particle, a bubble, or a droplet in gas and liquid. Picture it as a relay race where the baton gets passed from one participant to the other, ensuring smooth coordination and interaction between phases. Now, let's delve into the world of flow regimes. In the bubbly regime, bubbles of various sizes are scattered throughout the liquid, much like stars scattered across the night sky. As the gas flow rate increases, so does the average bubble size. When many bubbles merge, they form gas slugs, akin to a crowd of people coming together to form a larger group. As the gas flow rate further increases, the flow pattern morphs into a churn flow, which is as chaotic as a bustling city during peak hours. Now imagine a separation of the phases, much like traffic lanes segregating different vehicles. This is called annular flow. The liquid flows mainly on the tube wall, and the core gas is in the center, with liquid drops or droplets being carried in the core. To summarize, multi-phase flows are an intricate dance of gas, liquid, and solid phases, each with its own unique rhythm and pattern. Their flow rates, the transfer of mass, momentum, and energy, and the transition from one flow regime to another, bubbly, slug, churn, and annular, all weave together to create the complex phenomenon that is multiphase flow.